Hey guys, Sean King, Mr. Fence here. Still on vacation, believe it or not, and still messing with the fence. No. Like I told you guys last night, my boys uh, are doing some repairs to my dad's um, four rail vinyl fence. He had broke with the tractor a few of the post offs. So we posted last night how this tool works. It pulls these posts out of the ground, the concrete and all. It can be used to pull uh, damaged posts that broke off of the ground, and it can be used to pull brand new post out of the ground if you want to reuse them, if you want to move a fence and reuse them. The reason why is because this, this contraption goes all the way in the post, all the way down to the bottom of the post, and therefore it's not going to create any damage to the post above ground. If you use ratchet straps or brackets and holes, it can create damage to the post. And if you broke off the ground level like that one, there's nothing to grab a hold of to pull that slug out. All of these posts here have uh, about 160 pounds of concrete on each, so we put this fence in. 14 years ago or so, uh, they were all dry bagged, dry tamped. Um, but that concrete's rock solid and it's about 160 pounds. So to get that out of the ground, we've got this tool here. When it goes in the post, it's got a beveled edge and a sharp edge. And as we pull up, it creates friction here and it locks, drags that point, which rotates this, which wedges this piece inside the post. It wedges the post against the concrete and therefore generally pull the entire concrete slug out. Occasionally, it'll pull the vinyl post out of the slug, especially if you don't have the keyholes uh, in the bottom of the post. Like we have here, we don't have any keyholes in the bottom of the post. So it's a good chance to pull the post out of the concrete, but so far, it's pulled the entire slug out. So the way this works, we're going to drop this down inside our post. Just like that. Use a fork truck, a skid steer, hydraulic post puller, um, anything that has enough force to pull straight up. Go ahead and start this up. Tell that piece is locked in there right now, it's not going to come out the top. There are a couple options to get it back out. One, I can tap that with the tent bolt at the top. We'll pull the post over, get it from the bottom. And pull our tool back out, use it on the next one. 